Player 119. The crewmate who needs your help, but you shouldn't help him because he is a danger. So let's solve this mystery together. So to summon player 119, we must first understand his story. So according to the legend, player 119 is a ghost of a crewmate. Before he was eliminated from this earth, he begged for help in lobbies because a man was behind him. The man eliminated him, which is why he has a dagger on his helmet. His ghost lives on in Among Us and he will ask for help. But if you decide to help him, strange things will happen. So drop a like to protect yourself. I want to find this mysterious crewmate with your help. To begin the summon, I created my own lobby at 3 in the morning, which is when he's supposed to appear. I was selecting my mini crewmate and a hat, and I was going to select my color, but I saw that someone took it. I turned around and player 119 was here. I was shocked because he sent me a friend request as well and asked me to help him. I was really confused. Are you real? But the crewmate was asking for help. Make sure not to help him for your own safety. I got really creeped out so I left the lobby and I tried joining a new one. But as you can see the game didn't even want to load. Did player 119 cause this? I tried several times to join the lobby and it just wasn't working. Who knew a crewmate can have this much power? But finally I was let in. But player 119 followed me and started asking the crewmates for help until we finally entered the game. But things did not end there. It was only four of us and player 119 began to follow me. I was in the middle of doing my card swipe but he was watching all three of us. What could he be planning? I've heard of this legend before, but it has been a while since I've seen him. Me and the crewmates entered storage together, and he closed the door on us. Once the door finally opened, he just stood there, in pure silence. He then eliminated Rose right in front of me. To say I wasn't terrified was an understatement. I ran away for safety into upper engine, and I could see his legs walk by. He was looking for me. He knew I was hiding in this vent. The time was running out and I popped out in reactor where he saw me and he began to chase me across the scale. Was he going to eliminate me? This legendary crewmate? I'm not the one that did anything to you. But he didn't seem to want to leave me alone. He seemed to be wanting to play a game with me because he had the chance to get rid of me. I ran all the way to cafeteria and I was waiting for the opportunity to hop on the vent, which I did. I saw the opportunity to vent into admin and I could report Rose and finally make it out. I told the other crewmate that it's player 119. He responded with help. Dex said nah, but he's chasing me. Help me. He was also asking for help, but Dex said say anything red. It seems like she's trying to help him. So I told her, don't listen to him, please. But he kept on insisting to help him. And unfortunately, she said I'm voting orange. She decided to help player 119 and things are not going to end there. We both returned to the game and me and Dex vented, but she made a mistake of helping him. I was an admin again and player 119 was camping the door. Me and Dex were really nervous. We didn't know what to do with this crewmate. He closed the door on us as you guys can see right there. Me and Dex didn't know what to do. We were trapped in admin with him, but I decided to vent out of there and make it into cafeteria. Dex also followed me, but player 119 was right behind us. She then called a meeting and she said sorry. What? Player 119 said he's going to eliminate me. None of us were imposter by the way. He then said the man, the police doesn't want to answer. Dex, you have to listen to me. Don't listen to player 119. She said, what do you mean? I told her he is a ghost. Player 119 was referring to the man that eliminated him. We were back in the cafeteria and Dex realized her mistake. She listened to him, which was the worst thing that she could have done. Player 119 was staring at me, but then I noticed something. The game started to glitch and player 119 turned into a monster. I haven't seen him in so long. How is he able to transform like this into this 
large creature. O2 then went off, and he returned back to normal. I fixed O2 with Dex, but player 119 hasn't moved since he called O2. So I got close to him. This must be a glitched crewmate, since he is a ghost. I got closer to him. He didn't seem to react, but then he eliminated me, and he won the game. Don't listen to player 119. Dex seemed to understand. She banned him. Finally, we are free from that terrifying crewmate, but this happiness soon faded away. Player 119 joined the lobby. How is it possible he came back after he was banned from the lobby? I've never seen this before. Me and Dex were shocked in the cafeteria when we saw him return. We could not believe our eyes. Player 119 has returned and he called a sabotage and followed me. The game began to glitch and he transformed into a secret form. To say the least, I was really scared of this crewmate haunting us. I told Dex I thought you banned him and she said that she did. But player 119 kept begging for help even after Dex offered to help him. He kept chasing me on the scale. He did not want to leave me alone. He wanted revenge. We went back to the lobby and I asked Dex to ban him a second time, which she eventually did. Maybe now we're finally safe from player 119, but as I said that, a mysterious crewmate joined the lobby. This crewmate didn't have a name and didn't even have a color. Is that him? Did he join under a new identity? When we spawned in the cafeteria, I didn't see player 119 anywhere. Okay, maybe it wasn't him. I then heard a strange noise coming from the storage room. So I entered and at first I saw nothing. But then my game began to glitch and I saw player 119. This time he had a different look. His visor was completely gone and had red eyes that were glowing. I thought it was free but it was much worse. This is exactly why you don't want to help him. His form started to change, and he turned into his monster self. As you can see, this creature is pretty big, and he has the same eyes as player 119, and has wings that look very scary, and still has that dagger on his helmet. Player 119 started to approach me as his monster form, but luckily I managed to run away. But then I was shocked when I entered security. I saw player 119 as his crewmate self, and right behind him was a police officer trying to help him. Except this police officer had red eyes just like him. He won the game. Who is that police officer? If you want to know what happens next, like and subscribe, and check out these other stories.